Okay, question. How many of you remember these when they were a thing way back in the day? It seemed like every household had one of these. Hi, and welcome to my channel, Heartfelt Crochets by Darlene. Uh, here on my channel, you will find tutorials and crochet with me's and look what I've made. So if that's what you're looking for, then you've come to the right place. So grab a cup of coffee or whatever it is that you're drinking today. Come crochet with me. Oh, and hey, by the way, if you like the videos, give me a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified of all my upcoming videos. Okay, now let's go crochet. I remember when my mom made these. She also made like the Barbie dolls with the big dresses that would come over the toilet paper. And then once they were over the toilet paper, they would end up looking like those big, beautiful ball gowns. The legs of the dolls would go inside the toilet paper roll. Um, so I decided that I was going to try to make some of these to see how they would sell. I'm preparing for a market. Um, the middle of the end of May is going to be my first market. I've been trying to think of a few things that would be kind of different to see if they would sell again. And I decided to go ahead and try a couple different versions of these. <clears throat> this one here has a purple flower and it was a little bit loose because I made it bigger for like if you buy the the really big size like Charmin toilet paper then this one would fit over it as well so this is Scott toilet paper that's what I use and they're not sponsoring this video <laughs> that's what I use um so it was a little loose so I put a little bow on it and just tied it snug and I made it the same color as the middle of the flower and then the other one I made was this pink one this one has a little bit more of um, a flare at the brim of the hat it doesn't quite cover the whole thing as you can see right here but when the brim of the hat is down and it's sitting on a stand or the back of the toilet or wherever you decide that you're going to put it, it, it cover it's, it's wide enough so that you don't see the toilet paper. And this one has like a little rose and these are really easy to make. I'm going to have a, a crochet with me on making these. There's a couple of different ways, um, to make them. And I'll go over that too. The other one is this one. Why do I keep on looking over there? I'm looking at myself. I'm supposed to be looking at you. The other important peeps. Um, put the flower on top. It's a different version. So I have three right now. Got this one. The purple with the flower and the bow. Let's see if I can balance. I don't think I'm gonna be able to balance on top of that flower. Okay, let's do it this way. And this one. So, Let's see how they sell at the market. I will let you know. I'm really excited getting ready for this market. Um, it's my first one. There's a lot to prepare for because there's um, quite a few things that I need to get for the setup. I need to get a couple more um, six foot tables because I want to create like a U shape. Um, a tent 
in case it rains, I want to be undercover. I had a whole list of things that I need to get. I want to get some wooden crates. Oh, I need to get those sheets that fit over the tables. There's quite a few things I need to make. Pricing labels that you have in front of each thing that you're selling. And the smaller things, I'll end up having price tags on each one of them, so I have to do that. I still have quite a few things that I want to crochet for my inventory. Um, I'm starting to build up pretty good. You can see quite a few of the things behind me here. I don't know. There's a if, if I had a list here, if I prepared a little bit better and I had a list here, um, I would rattle off all of the things that I still need to get, but I'm trying not to get overwhelmed um, because this is just going to be a one-time purchase thing. And then after that, I just got to crochet my little heart out and just go to the markets and not have to worry about um, all of those things. So um, in preparing for that, I'm trying to come up with new ideas. This is one of them, the household dishcloths toilet paper holders. What was the other thing that I had on my list? Just one other thing I do. Oh, coasters, a set of six coasters. And they end up, I had like a little, I crocheted like a little pouch that they go into. I crocheted that and gave it as a Christmas gift to a Chinese Christmas party that we uh, went to last year. Hopefully the person that got it is enjoying it. So that's what I wanted to share with you today. If you can come up with any ideas um, that I might be able to bring to my market, I don't want to go outside of the amigurumi and you know crocheting just a little like household things and a couple uh, accessory things, not actual clothes or anything, just accessories. If you come up with some ideas, throw them in the comments below and I would appreciate it because um, I'm a little bit brain dead right now on coming up with some ideas on what to make. And yep, subscribe so that you get notified of upcoming videos. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And don't forget to comment and give me some ideas. Have a wonderful day. Bye.